All right, Rich, well, last minute shopping, the whole family in town, the kids home from school. Chances are you're a little stressed this time of the year. So, our resident acupuncturist, Dr. Ed Lemondred, is here with us with some new, fun, easy ways to relax, even if it's just a couple of minutes of simple things like rest. Absolutely. Or aromatherapy, things like that. So, let's talk about um, pressure points. So you, you said you wanted to talk about something you can do with your hands. So How does do that it work? yourself. Um, what we can do. So acupressure points using the the acupuncture meridians in the body. Uh -huh. These are points that are actually designed to soothe the nervous system. Okay. And help with sleep, which is a big thing. I mean, yeah. this this time of year, people are going through anxiety, depression, um, sleepless nights. Worrying about gifts and, and money and resources. And so these are little things that we can do to kind of just settle down a little bit. Okay. So the first point is right in the hand, right in the middle of the palm. And so basically, if you take your fingers into this crease, right in the middle You're is this about point. This, this crease here. Absolutely. Let's see. And so that point. Right there, that right big crease. There. Oh, that one. All right. That's the one. You bring your fingers down to that point. Just to show you where it is, but what you would do is just with the thumb of your other hand, okay. just get that point, apply a little bit of pressure, yeah. and rub in a circle. That's it? But do you keep That's your it. fingers clenched like this? Nope. No, no, no. no. Okay. You're just doing that just to find the point. Oh, gotcha. And so you would do that just and take deep breaths, so 30 seconds, and then do 30 seconds on the other hand, uh -huh. and that'll help to settle your breathing down. Okay. Next point is on the forearm, on the inner forearm. And it's right between these two tendons, right Let's there. Let's see if we can show the camera better. Oh. All right. Now, how precise do you have to be with this? This. So spot? normally the measurement is about two, two and a fingers half down. fingers okay. off of the the wrist crease. Okay. So as long as you're between the two tendons here, that'll work. This is also a great point for uh, indigestion, for nausea. Um, it's your seasickness point. Hmm. as well. Um, so rubbing this point will also slow down your breathing, calm down your nervous system, and okay. also help with sleep. Okay. Uh, two other points which are in the face are actually great for headaches. One of the side effects, one of the symptoms of this type of stress are going to be stress headaches. So the first point is this point Go right ahead. here. So right in the middle of the forehead, mm -hmm. between the two eyebrows, right there. Okay. And so you would just take a finger, press in, and rub in small circles. This is also be, going to be great for sinus headaches, any kind of stress headaches. Now I saw you close your eyes. Do you close your eyes? Well, that would be that would be nice. I mean, is that kind of just setting the mood? Absolutely. Would you want music playing, like something soft in the background? Is well, the, the whole idea is that just to kind of bring you down? It is. You could do it at home, but you could do it in the car. If you're you just found that parking spot. You're trying to settle down. You're trying to gear up to get on <laughs> those long lines. <laughs> and just do this for 30 seconds, and it'll put you in a different space. Okay, one more spot. All right, the next spot is on the sides of the forehead. Okay. At the end, right there. Yeah, I'll turn it. Sorry about that. Right there at the end of your eyebrow. Oh, so, okay. also a good headache spot. I mean, think about it this way. When you are suffering from a headache, most people will start rubbing their temples. Okay, right. There's, there's some benefit to that. So, rubbing your temples will actually also calm things down, especially when you've got a lot of frenetic energy. Oh, my God, what am I going to get for so-and-so and so-and-so? And so? Just, Just right there on the temples. Absolutely. Okay, so those are some free things you can do. Uh, what about aromatherapies? So aromatherapy is great. So these are actually blends that I brought in. Um, there's calm and there's sleep. And what you could do is just spray a little bit on a cotton ball. Mm -hmm. And when you go to sleep, just put the cotton ball on your chest. Oh, just don't put it on you. Just You can put it on you, but this is an easy way. And you would also, whenever you're using essential oils, you want to test the skin to make sure you don't have a reaction. Oh, rash or something. But you okay. can put it on your clothing to smell it. So during the day, you have that scent always with you. Just to kind of, ah. And a lot of these blends have lavender and chamomile, mm -hmm. which are essential mm -hmm. oils that have been shown to relax people. That smells great. Okay. And where can you find most of these aromatherapies? So, um, aromatherapy essential oils are, are available all over the place. Yeah. I uh, offer these in my office, and new patients that are coming in actually get a bottle. Okay. 
What location of your office? Uh, in Mesa on Baseline. Baseline That's your Road. new one. Congratulations. Absolutely. Thanks very much. In your new place. All right. Dr. Lemadre, thank you very much.